Hi, this is Joe from Beards, Blades, and Hair, and today we'll be doing a review of the, let's see if we can find the naming, the Chicago Comb, Carbon Fiber Comb, number eight. It's a very, 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 very famous beard comb. So you can already see I have a little bit of problems with this comb. Don't hate it. Don't get me wrong. Don't hate it. I use it. I definitely use it. Um, but what I use it for is a very specific, it's a very specific thing. So whenever I either dampen my beard or um, take a shower, um, I always make sure to comb through with this. Um, basically because it's very tough and it does a really good job, um, you know, dealing with the, the, the water that I'm using whenever I'm showering or whenever I'm dampening the beard. And the other comb that I'm going to discuss today, um, I don't, it's wooden, so I haven't never tested it, putting a lot of water on it, putting soap on it, because I actually comb through using this with soap, um, and obviously it's held up perfectly fine. Um, so those are all good things, and I really do enjoy that um, as a part of, part of that comb, but I don't really um, use it outside of that. So... I know that this is the, <laughs> the hottest comb on the planet um, in the beard world, uh, for sure. Everybody loves it, everybody talks about it. Um, and I'm applying beard butter, um, but that's not the review today. <laughs> um, but everybody talks about it, everybody loves it, and it, it definitely you know has its uses. Um, but overall, um, I don't think it's the best detangler. Uh, that's one problem <laughs> with it, is I definitely don't think it's the best detangler for your beard. Um, obviously in the shower, great, but for a beard that, you know, you're applying beard oil to, um, so say you're going to see in this example, I've applied beard butter and I'm going to comb through using my favorite comb, which is a wooden one. Um, and I think it, it just is a lot better as a detangler and a lot smoother and a lot more comfortable. And there's actually another factor too, that... I definitely want to mention is um, the Chicago comb. Um, hey, maybe your hair is a certain way, um, but for my hair, it is horrendous. <laughs> Absolutely horrendous. Um, maybe you don't care about that. Maybe where your hair is, it's fine. Um, but for my hair, I'm gonna give you a demonstration, the comparison between the other comb that I'm gonna show you and the Chicago comb, just how different they are um, in terms of what your head hair looks like after you've come through. Um, so that being said, um, I'll, just to demonstrate, I'll, I'll grab the Chicago comb again and, and show if I try to comb through, yeah, it just gets, it gets stuck. Um, it's not horrendous, you, you'd be fine. Uh, but I don't think it's, I just don't think it's that great at it. Um, in comparison to, da, 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 this is the, focus. Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements Wooden Comb. They only have one comb. Um, I'll drop a link for it below, but um, this is their wooden comb. Um, and you can see me just kind of plowing right through the hair. No real issues, no real tangles, no problems. Um, even when I get stuck, give it a little wiggle, a little wiggle wiggle, and it just kind of gets right through smoothly, comfortably, no problems at all. And obvious downsides being I can't run this one in the shower if I could, or if I did, I bet you it'd fall apart, it's wood. Um, and the other downside is they do wear out. Um, I'd say you probably get six months of use out of them. Um, they don't so much wear out, but they start to get gross. And if you ever try to clean them, you don't even bother, they just fall apart. <laughs> like, it just, it just doesn't work. So um, there's definitely downsides to it. But as far as, a, as an overall comb doing what it needs to do, um, it's just excellent. Um, detangles extremely well. Um, works, makes the beard look great. Makes the beard look awesome. Super, super comfortable. And then the head hair. I'm gonna show you an example. So, I got pretty excited when I bought, when I bought the Chicago comb. Um, you know, just just something new and also something as mentioned before, shower, all that good stuff. Uh, but oh boy, wait till we see the head. All right, you ready? This is what it looks like if you use it on the head hair. Uh huh. That's this uh-huh and uh -huh. so you see all those big honking gaps there that you get on your head um this looks terrible <laughs> it just looks bad um 
I hate it. Uh, yeah, so I know that's not a factor for all of you. A lot of you are just, you're just using it for the beard. Um, but if you want something to actually make your hair look nice, um, this thing has much, actually the best thing would be to do comparison. So if you look at the, I don't know if it'll focus on both, but let's just do one at a time. So Chicago comb, here's the, the width of the, uh, of the tines, is that the word? And then you look at the width here on the Phoenix Arts and Accoutrements comb is a lot better, uh, or a lot closer. And so instead of having big gap, silly hair, um, you get nice, smooth, <laughs> normal hair. And obviously I don't really care right now for, I'm gonna be going to bed soon, but from for going out in the day, um, this looks about a billion times better. Um, looks about a billion times tighter and smoother and just, just better overall. I wanna make sure I make it look decent. It's a little hard to tell, but, but yeah, I mean, you, you get the difference, um, it's huge. So what's the overall conclusion? I think um, the Chicago comb number eight is a good um, tool to add to your toolbox. I'm still using it consistently. I'm still, um, I I'm gonna keep using it consistently. I think it definitely serves its purpose. Um, but in reality, the best beard comb on the market um, overall, and also in my opinion, the best comb period is the Phoenix Artist and Accoutrements wooden comb. Uh, this one's five bucks, but you gotta replace it. And then this one is this one is thirteen bucks, um, but it should last your whole life. If it'll focus, there we go. <laughs> it'll last thirty bucks, but it'll last your whole life. Um, so that being said, um, this has been Joe from Beards, Blades, and Hair. Um, thank you, and until next time.